Okay, so first you want to start with half a Nutribullet cup of ice, um, and then you want to add one banana. This originally was meant to be a smoothie recipe, but it turns into a banana smoothie bowl. Um, but it's still delicious. Um, so you just want to break that up into the bowl. And then next you want to add half a teaspoon of pea protein powder. I use the Seven Hills one because it's actually really good value for money. Um, you can order on Amazon really easily. But I will link um, all these products down below so they'll be really easy for you to go get hold of. You then want to add um, one teaspoon of chia seeds to the mix. Um, I use this little measuring spoon. So it's quite easy to get um, all the measurements right and they're all equal. You then want to add half a teaspoon of maca powder into it. Um, this gives it a really creamy and like caramelly taste. It's so yummy. So next I add in some coconut milk. Um, it's my favourite non-dairy milk because it tastes really sweet. Um, I use Rutel. They sell it at most whole food shops and waitrose, so it's really easy to get hold of. Then you want to add my favourite nut butter, um, which is almond butter, and I use Pippin Nut, which is my favourite because it's so like creamy and smooth. It's... You then just want to add half a teaspoon of ground cinnamon into the Nutribullet. Um, this is really good for your skin and it will give you a really glowing complexion. You then just want to pop the lid on and blend it all together until it's smooth. Give it a little shake and blend some more. This is the part where I remembered that I forgot to put the dates in. Um, this gives it a really sweet taste um, and also it wasn't blending very well so I added a little bit of water. You then just want to pop the lid back on and blend a bit more so all the dates mix in. And then you can just empty it out into a bowl. I first attempted putting it into a glass and it went everywhere. Um, that's because it was a bit thick so I could have added a bit more milk. But um, yeah, it turned into a smoothie bowl which was delicious. I then just sprinkled some um, granola on top. This is like no sugar, it's just honey that sweetens it. Um, so it's just like oats, pumpkin seeds, almonds, it's really yummy. Um, and then I sprinkled some cacao nibs. And later on I put coconut flakes on, but I forgot to do that at this stage. Look at that, this is just making me want to eat it all over again. So this is the near finished product, and um, I just forgot one more thing. At this point I remembered to put coconut chips on. Whoops! Um, yeah, so I just sprinkled a few of them in. This gives it a really nice coconutty flavour and really complements the milk. <laughs> So this originally was going to be a banana and date smoothie, but it turned into a smoothie bowl. I'm not even angry. 